Hey there subscribers and uh, new found visitors to my YouTube channel. I hope you subscribe. This is a quick tutorial for how to download RStudio. This seems to be a challenging issue for many folks. So before we used to head over to rstudio.com and if you search in Google you'll find many references that will take you to false websites so be very very careful. But you see now when I do this video they're heading over to postit.co so we're going to head over to postit.co and we're going to get the latest version of R. All the release notes are still here, but they're in the process of migrating. So we're going to head over to postit.co and we're going to see that that's the new name. So we're going to hit download R Studio and we're going to see R Studio desktop and we're going to download R Studio right there. And first it's going to tell us we need to install R. So we're going to make sure we download and install R to start out with. And to do that, we're going to go over to this page, cran.rstudio.com, and we're going to download it for our operating system. So download R for Windows in my case. And we get over here. We're going to actually want us to do this for the first time, install R for the first time. We're going to choose that option. And we're going to click here, download R 4.2.2. And I'm going to run that executable, but I'm already set to go, so I do not need to do that. So first I got the R libraries all necessary on my computer to run R. I'm going to go back over here to the actual R Studio download. I'm going to download that. There's also other ones out there for other operating systems, so pay close attention for what you need. But for Windows, we're going to download this. That's going to be an installation that we download. It's about 200 megabytes, so it might take a little bit of time to download. But once you have that download, just run the installer. It's pretty straightforward. Keep the defaults or change them to your liking. And once you're done, this is what you should have. This is my RStudio environment. I have some R code here that's up and working, but if I click run, you'll see that my R is working as I would expect. Pretty quick and easy, and I'll just show you if I go to my help and I go to about RStudio, this is one of the latest builds. Hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any comments, need any assistance or questions, please let me know. Thank you very much. Hope you subscribe.